Okay, here we are back again with Mass Effect, and let's see if we can do this. We've got access to base security. We should be able to cut the alarms from here. Might even be able to trigger alarms on the far side of base. It'll clear out the guards for us, but they might be too much for the Salarian teams to handle. We're gonna go with they've got enough trouble. Is that way. Just disable the alarms. We can handle any guards inside. Yeah, it's not a big deal. Okay, let's go. These indoctrinated dudes. Salarian. Right. The captain said he had lost some men. Yeah. Yeah, he did. Indoctrinated. I wonder what that means. Ooh, I'm sure we'll probably find out at some point. Oh, oh boy. <laughs> Mostly you just don't want those guys to get real close. Uh, uh... Okay. Like, yeah, sending sending the alarm or setting off alarms on the other side of the base like makes it so that you don't have as many enemies to fight on this side but like I cleared those guys out with no problem and I suck at this game I'm playing on normal so you know it's not really an issue Hello. is someone out there hmm this is the part where you can start making mistakes if you go pure paragon but I like that about this game and I do it intentionally because it makes sense from how I are. Give a ground, Williams. So we don't want them to bunker up. Draw them out. Hard decryption. Boy, oh boy. Okay. Let's, uh... I don't know if we're going in the right place yet or not. No, I don't want to go here yet. Hang on. <laughs> I forget how this goes. Let's go over here first. What do you want? I told you everything. I... Who are you? Alliance, right? I knew someone would come. It tried to break me, but it couldn't. I shut it out. Slow down. I need to know where you came from. Private Maino Savat of the 3rd Infiltration Regiment STG, ma'am. Captured while on reconnaissance six days ago. Glad to answer, ma'am. Never any questions from these bastards. Just whispers and poking and cutting. I'd have said anything to get out and get some payback. That's not too much to ask, is it? A little payback? What did they do to you, soldier? Experiments, but I don't know what for. The effect of incessant whispering on my shortening temper. Who knows? I just need out. Something's not right here, Shepard. Setting him free could endanger the mission. No. No! I, I need to get out. This room is too small and it keeps talking and I really want to get out of here and get some work done. I need to get out. Let me out. Um, you see, this is the point where it's like, well, do I want to go Pure Paragon? Because this guy's obviously indoctrinated. But... I can't take that chance. Can't take that chance. No chance. I need to do what it says. I have to. Let me out. Yeah, no. Let me out! Let me out! Let me out! Let me out! Yep, that was definitely the correct decision. <laughs>
won't let me through. Maybe there's some stuff back here. Now we gotta backtrack, retrace our steps, and then get back to that elevator. Oop, wrong way. <laughs> it's like, whoa, that's all right, really. Perimeter secure. But I do appreciate in this game that sometimes it's a pure paragon. Like, most of the time, the pure paragon decisions are fine but once in a while you can make a paragon choice that'll come back and bite you in the ass later oh boy well let's you know poke it why not Overheat. Oops, somebody hit me with What is going overload. on here? Where are the guards? Where is Saren? No, stay back. This is important work. This is the glorious salvation of my species. You will not destroy the work we have started. Doctor. That's not, that's not correct. You know, that's just not correct. Thanks, guys. I just need to save. Okay. Moving along. Don't shoot! Please, I just want to get out of here before it's too late. I'm not going to hurt you. Who are you? Ranathanoptis, neurospecialist. Oh, yeah? But this job isn't worth dying over, or worse. You think the indoctrination only affects prisoners? Sooner or later, Saren will want to dissect my brain, too. What? I thought this was a breeding facility. Not this level. We're studying Sovereign's effect on organic minds. At least that's what I assumed. Saren kept us in the dark as much as possible. You helped him and you didn't even know why? I didn't have the option of negotiating. This position is a little more permanent than I had expected. But I can help you. This elevator behind me goes to Saren's private lab. I can get you in. See? Full access. All of Saren's private files. Are we good? Can I go? What were you studying here? It's that ship, Sovereign. It emits some kind of signal. Ooh. Undetectable, but it's there. I've seen the effects. Saren uses it to influence his followers. To control them. It's called indoctrination. Direct exposure to the signal turns you into a mindless slave, like the Solarian test subjects. But there's collateral damage, too. What do you mean by collateral damage? Sovereign's signal is too strong. Spend too much time near the ship and you feel it. Like a tingle at the back of the skull. It's like a whisper you can't quite hear. You're compelled to do things, but you don't know why. You just obey. Eventually, you just stop thinking for yourself. It happens to everyone at the facility. My first test subject was the man I replaced. Now I just want to get out of here before it happens to me. Tell me more about this signal. Signal's not exactly the right word. There is some kind of energy field emanating from the ship. It changes thought patterns. Over time, days, maybe a week, it weakens your will. You become easier to manipulate and control, but it's a degenerative condition. There's a balance between control and usefulness. The less freedom a subject maintains, the less capable it becomes. Why is Saren researching this? Isn't he the one controlling it? The signal yeah. comes from the ship. It makes us obey Saren, but I don't think he controls it. Not exactly. I think he's scared it might be affecting him. 
Ooh. Indoctrination is subtle. <coughs> By the time the effects become noticeable, it's usually too late. I'm gonna blow this place to hell and gone. If you wanna make it out alive, you better start running. <coughs> what? You can't. But I'll never. Oh! <laughs> yeah, go. <laughs> you enjoyed that, Commander. I sure did. I sure did. Oh, Ranith and Optus. You're so unethical. Like, yeah, she's happy to do all this stuff until, right up until she realizes her own life is in danger. She only cares about her own skin, though. Okay. Let's go see what Saren's been hiding. Commander, look over here. It's another beacon, like the one on Eden Prime. It sure is. This is one of my favorite parts of the game. I just like how they don't even react to it. I get the feeling something bad is about to happen. Me too. You are not Saren. What is that? Some kind of VI interface? Rudimentary creatures of blood and flesh. You touch my mind, fumbling in ignorance, incapable of understanding. I don't think this is a VI. There is a realm of existence so far beyond your own, you cannot even imagine it. I am beyond your comprehension. I am Sovereign. Sovereign isn't just some Reaper ship Saren found. It's an actual Reaper. Reaper, a label created by the Protheans to give voice to their destruction. In the end, what they chose to call us is irrelevant. We simply... Are. The Protheans vanished 50,000 years ago. You couldn't have been there. It's impossible. Organic life is nothing but a genetic mutation. An accident. Your lives are measured in years and decades. You wither and die. We are eternal. The pinnacle of evolution and existence. Before us, you are nothing. Your extinction is inevitable. We are the end of everything. There is an entire galaxy of races united and ready to face you. Confidence born of ignorance. The cycle cannot be broken. Cycle? What cycle? The pattern has repeated itself more times than you can fathom. Organic civilizations rise, evolve, advance. And at the apex of their glory, they are extinguished. The Protheans were not the first. They did not create the Citadel. They did not forge the mass relays. They merely found them. The legacy of my kind. Why would you construct the mass relays, then leave them for someone else to find? Your civilization is based on the technology of the mass relays. Our technology. By using it, your society develops along the paths we desire. We impose order on the chaos of organic evolution. You exist because we allow it, and you will end because we demand it. They're harvesting us. 
They're here to wipe us out. What do you want from us? Slaves? Resources? My kind transcends your very understanding. We are each a nation. Independent. Free of all weakness. You cannot even grasp the nature of our existence. Where are the rest of the Reapers? Are you the last of your kind? We are Legion. The time of our return is coming. Our numbers will darken the sky of every world. You cannot escape your doom. Where did you come from? Who built you? We have no beginning. We have no end. We are infinite. Millions of years after your civilization has been eradicated and forgotten, we will endure. You're not even alive. Not really. You're just a machine, and machines can be broken. Your words are as empty as your future. I am the vanguard of your destruction. This exchange is over. Oops. Commander, we got trouble. Yeah. Really? Hit me, Joker. That ship's sovereign? It's moving. I don't know what you did down there, but that thing just pulled a turn that would shear any of our ships in half. It's coming your way, and it's coming hard. You need to wrap things up in there fast. This console's been disabled. Orders, Commander. Let's head to the breeding facility. Joker can pick us up after we set the nuke. Okay, good idea. Yeah. So that was quite the info dump. Hostile contact. Oh boy. The gas returning from your position, JTO. Looks like Shadow picked a sensitive spot. Williams, head them off. Hold them. Whoops. Lost contact. Krogans stay behind cover, they're gonna keep regening health. But as soon as they come out from cover, they start charging you. Like this guy. Okay. Cool. Alright, so, I think next time we'll try and destroy this breeding facility because this is kind of a mess, and also apparently so Reapers are sentient robots, so that's cool. Um, set to destroy all civilization in the galaxy, that's even cooler. So yeah, um, next time we'll hopefully destroy this facility, we're gonna nuke it. So yeah, uh, as always, if you like what you see, please like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you in the next episode. Later!